Davina McCall says that people in the public eye should be forgiven if they change their minds or make a mistake. The Masked Singer Judge, 55, was talking to Rylan Clark for his podcast, Rylan's Reunion, in 2022. She said she is sad that forgiveness isn't on the agenda anymore and also revealed she wouldn't change anything about her addictive past as a teenager. On cancel culture, where an individual becomes widely ostracized by the public for an unpopular view they may have aired, the former Big Brother host said, This is the new thing that I think celebrities or actors or anybody in the public eye is the most terrified of. You say something and you get cancelled. I think it's about the lack of forgiveness that anybody is allowed to have for making a mistake. One of the things that I think is really weird is hauling somebody over the coals for a tweet they made in 2011. In 12 years, I've changed so much. Don't miss. Rachel Stevens dating dancing on ice partner after marriage split, latest Paul O'Grady's ex-wife of 28 years breaks silence on star's sad death, news Monty Don and wife lost everything as they were left almost bankrupt, news, you've got to be allowed to change your mind. Sometimes people could have been racist or homophobic 10 years ago or 12 years ago and they might have met somebody along the way who has made them change the light. She added, we must not stop the voices that annoy us or aggravate us or say something different by shaming them. It seems that forgiveness isn't on the agenda anymore. It seems really sad. Davina had no regrets about her well-documented drug-taking past. In France, it was crazy. I was 14, allowed to go away with a bunch of 20-year-olds for a weekend, and took loads of drugs. I thought I was it, I was so cool and knew what's going on. I didn't know what was going on. I didn't have the emotional maturity to deal with what was happening to me. But she said, I wouldn't change my past. I'm sad I had to go through it but I did learn a lot from it. And it has made me who I am today. And I am a very different person to that girl back then, 